Hey guys, this is Ada coming in with another quick word. The other night I had a dream and it was last week and I actually made the video, but I don't know. It was just something about the presentation that I didn't like, so I deleted it. But the dream was, um, I don't know what it was a dream or vision, guys, but here it is. But anyway, I was, um, noticed that there was a guy who was driving this black old looking pickup, right? And in that truck, um, he had a child. And the child just kind of looked unkempt, kind of wild. And I noticed the front window was broken. So there was nothing to shield that child. And it's like the front part of that truck had a jagged. The glass was broken and it was jagged. And I remember the child was kind of sitting, leaning toward the jagged glass that was broken. And so in my mind, I was saying, oh, Lord, you know, um, he need to secure that child but like i said the child looked like he was just maybe seven just like a wild child or whatever and um he was you know of course children ain't it's not as concerned with their safety but he was just you know um it was something about the child that was off don't know what it was but anyway I looked around, this guy had came into the home. It didn't look like it was my house, but it came into somebody's house. So I don't know if it, this was even for me. But he came into the house and he stole the TV. Took the TV out. And nobody noticed that the TV was gone. But it was a pretty large TV. So the next round he came back and I actually saw him come. And he had a gun. And I want to say he had that same child with him. But anyway, he came, he was coming toward the door and I ran and I went to tell whoever I was in the house that the guy had a gun. So with that being said, guys, um, the drink had ended. I don't know. I think I jawed away because I was trying to run and tell, alert people what was happening. And so, you know, thank you, Lord. Holy Spirit just was telling me that's why, you know, he sent it so I could warn people that's why i was in a rush i saw it and other people didn't see it and i saw the destruction that was coming but anyway guys that that image represent um the image of christ and who we truly are and the enemy that guy in the truck represents the enemy and looked like he had maybe a baby christian with him and that baby looked wild and they were kind of deceived but he came in, he stole the TV, and nobody saw him. He came in unaware. And so a lot of times the enemy will come in, and he will come in unaware, unannounced. And nobody understand that, you know, what's going on until something drastic happened. Okay, when he came back, he was coming back for destruction. He had already taken that image. He had already stolen your identity. And so his next tactic was to come back in to steal kill and destroy now i don't know who this is for but i know trucks or cars normally represent uh, ministries and guys there are a lot of counterfeit ministries out there now and i'm not talking about anybody in particular but there's a lot of false doctrine and their goal is to steal the image of christ from the body of believers and then he will come in and steal kill and destroy so this may be for many of you. It may be for a few. But test the spirit by the spirit. And there are a couple of videos where I talked about um, the book of Jude. Where there are blemishes at your love, love feast according to the word. And they, they come, you know, as if they are believers in Christ. When actually they're wolves in sheep clothing. And the Bible says there are blemishes at your love feast. They are twice dead. So guys, be mindful. Be mindful of who you're letting into your space. Be mindful of your doctrine. Be watchful. Because that second time when he came back, he came to steal, kill, and destroy. It ain't necessarily got to be a physical death. It could be a death of the things that God has promised you. But first, he wants to steal your identity. And the way he do that, you have to know that you are anointed and appointed in Christ. And if he can come in and take your identity, then he have you. And with that being said, guys, uh, go back if you can and watch the video um, that I did about, um, I don't I don't know what the title is, but if you could just kind of go through my videos, not seeing, you have to watch them, but it's probably going to be the last few that I did.
but with that being said guys if this video has been helpful please give it a thumbs up and you know stay tuned for the next video